Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. We survey Milan's famous Corva Sud, one of the truly great shrines of the beautiful game. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Plays it out to the wing. Just brushed off the ball there. And now the breakaway. And it's got through. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. And he's whipped it in low. Dashing forward at pace. Done very well to intervene. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Out to the left it goes. Back into the middle. Ball driven towards the far post. But that is good defending. It's been repelled. And now they can launch a counter. A real chance to break. And that's clear cut. It's a free kick. And he just whacks it away. There's a lot of movement going on, there's no shortage of options. So I guess they're looking to play around their opponents as opposed to through them. Yeah, the style is designed to dominate the ball and so you dominate your opponents. Great ball and now the shot! Aimed long and direct. Oh, it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Lifting it over. It's a loose ball. He's got away. Tries to get it forward quickly. Turns and goes back. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Danger averted for now, and it's Agliano. It's the through ball, and he's onside, shoots! It's being played forward, questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Very well played, he saw that coming. Dinks one in. Buffon sends that a long way. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And he's made certain that won't get through. Has he picked him out? Pietov catches it safely.
pushes it out wide. Whipped in. Gets up to head it! Out of play for a goal kick. Fires it in low. Trying to get... Shoots! And that really should have hit the net. He's played him through. He's had a go! And it's half-time here. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. So they head in no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. Start of the second half. Milan playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. He's had a shot! And he's there to cut it out. Aimed long and direct. Hit into the... In with a header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Top has got himself a free kick. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Battles to win it back. He's left his man. Going through. Crowd calling for him to shoot. He can get that clear. He's gone for a throw in. Throw in. Already, he's given away possession cheaply. Looks to clip it, hits one, hits it. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. By a Leverkusen, take the lead. Or well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half time, it's worth a treat. Can he finish? Can he find a finish now? Forward it goes. That intervention was very necessary. And that's well defended. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Goes long. Here it comes. Milan are definitely going about this the right way. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Shapes the shoots. They've scored! And with that goal comes comfort. 
That was glorious. Pinpoint accuracy. You know, what was notable in that, Peter, was the fact that he didn't try to blast it. He chose placement instead and delivered a peach. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Mattel. Now the counter. Now it's Adriano. Tries to get it forward quickly. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Great ball! Oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Now it's Adriano. Quick ball forward. Could move up a gear here. Room for a shot. It's broken loose. Pumps it into the area. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. He's got a chance from here, but not the kindest angle. Towering header! Yes! And surely that settles it. One delightful ball, and the rest was simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Out towards the flank. Aimed long and direct. Barbel. It's come loose. Tries to get it forward quickly. There is the final whistle. Milan thoroughly outclassed here. They came up against opponents who were better in all areas. No argument. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Milan simply forgot to turn up with an attack, Peter, and that lack of cutting edge could possibly turn into something more serious for them. Well, that's it from us. Thanks very much, Jim. It's a very good day to you from both of us.